Le'Veon Bell is one of the best running backs in the NFL. Not only is he a good runner, he's an excellent receiver out of the backfield. In the Steelers-Bengals game in Week 7, he gained a total of 192 yards with 58 of them through the air. On a second down and two in the middle of the second quarter, Bell took this check down for 42 yards down the field. So what happened and how did Bell break free for this long gain? Well, pre-snap, the Bengals have two safeties deep and then play man coverage on the receivers. The Steelers line up with 12 personnel, which means they have a running back and two tight ends on the field. Big Ben takes a five-step drop out of shotgun and looks right to see if Antonio Brown is open. He is covered and so is the tight end on the right side so he moves on to his check down. Bell catches the pass to the 41-yard line and jukes pass to Mike Linebacker. He now has a first down, but instead of getting tackled, number 89 boxes out the weak side linebacker. After that, number 55 takes a poor angle and the number 43 gets blasted out of the play. At this point, Bell has just one guy to beat. It's cornerback Draker Patrick and Bell annihilates him to the ground with a nasty stiff arm. This is what allows him to get into secondary for the long game. In summary, Bell showed elusiveness with the ball in his hands, strength to stay on his feet, and great vision to see the downfield blocks by the offense. His ability to create with minimal space is second to none in the NFL. It's clear he deserves to get paid as the top running back, and that's what I fully expect during the next offseason. The Steelers would end up kicking a field goal in this drive, but they would still win the game 29-14.